the first word in television game shows, the all-new Crosswitz. Today's special guest stars, brilliant impressionist comedian, Fred Travelina. Television actress and personality, Marsha Wallace. One of today's brightest comedians, Brad Garrett. And from General Hospital, beautiful Jacqueline Seaman. Today, one of our contestants can win one of these three fabulous cars and a vacation of a lifetime to Micronesia on the only crosswind. Here to help us figure it all out is our host, David Park. Well, if only you knew how thrilled I am to be here, uh, you'd come and join us right in the studio audience. Those of you who already have, welcome to the show. And those of you at home, I hope uh, you're going to have the time of your life as you view the contest between some great teams. We have Fred, and we have Marsha, and we have Brad, and we have Jackie as contestants. We have Carolyn, and we also have Rena. And with that, Michelle, let's hear about the rules. You'll be given clues to words in a crossword puzzle, all of which add up to a person, place, or thing. Answering the clues correctly gives you control of the game, and the letters in these answers are worth points. Stars can help with the crossword answers, but only the contestant can solve the puzzle for bonus points. And thank you so much. Let us see the first puzzle. Stars, contestants, we are looking for a, can you guess? A thing. Yes, that was beautifully done. And Rena. You won the flip backstage, so we're going to start with you and the handsome Brad Garrett. Please stop. Stop, Dave. I'm one of your biggest fans, Brad. Well, thank you. You have to get out more. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> Rena, would you get us started, please? Okay, I'll try number three down. This is a very uh, fortuitous beginning. <clears throat> a transvestite's favorite kind of racing. Uh, drag. A uh, drag, yeah. Hey. Oh. Yeah. Oh, wow. That one I knew was... Yeah, yeah, that, he got that one, yes. Very nicely done. That was worth um, 20 points. Can you something here? Great. <laughs> okay. How about number five across for Jackie? Yes, five across for Jackie. The crowd a wolf hangs out with. <clears throat> the crowd a wolf hangs out with. Oh, dear. Uh, group. Really? Group. Oh, pack. Say it a little it louder. Pack. Pack. Okay, how about number one down? Brad, when a lonely flame dies, blank gets in your eyes. Oh, well, I think when a flame dies, it's a little tiny speck. Could that be? Speck is not what we were looking for, although that was a good choice. It wasn't spec. Give me my gun. Rainy. <laughs> I don't have it here. No, um, I don't know. Which means you have 40 points. We are over to Caroline. Okay. And we are going to probably go to Fred Travelina. And one down, right? One down. Do you want to fill in the answer and I'll see if the question fits? When a lonely flame dies, blank gets in your eyes. Well, I would... I'll say this as Ronald Reagan. Well, no. Smoke. <laughs> yeah. Yes, that's correct. <laughs> Caroline. Four across, please. Are you making that noise? Uh, no. Oh, I'm trying good. To thank quit. goodness. I'm trying I was to quit, as a matter you. of fact, Marcia. Here's your, uh, here is your clue on Crosswitz. We're plugging our oh, show yes, at this see, point, I... of course. Your team may work together like a well oiled. Machine. Yes, well machine. machine. Do you want me to call you Caroline or Carolyn? Caroline. Well, I did a good job, didn't I? <laughs> yes, you All did. right, Caroline. A um, few more points here. How about two down? Fred, he always gets to sleep with the queen. <laughs> the king. Uh... The king. <laughs> Take a look up at the puzzle. You got almost everything filled in. All we have is six across. Uh, do you want to solve it? I'll solve it. How about cigarettes? A cigarette, cigarette happens to be correct. Well. Yes. Well done. Let's take a look at the puzzle. Six across was light. Light, smoke, machine, king, drag, pack. All add up to cigarette. And uh, 
Uh, that was very nicely done, Caroline. Now. Gets in your eyes. Speck gets in your eyes. No, no, that's not what we were looking for. But Brad, maybe that'll be a clue in the future, and we'll look for you for the answer. Um, Caroline, you are a uh, a manager of a liquor store. It says here, and you're from uh, where is this, Marsha? Cucamonga, California. Cucamonga, California. Yay. Marsha just got married there. And where I was married at the Buddhist temple in Cucamonga, California. Yes. 18. What's what do you do there in Cucamonga other than sell uh, liquor? There's not much more to do, no. I do. Uh, well, at this point, one always says, nice to see you on the show, Caroline. You're doing very well, and uh, good luck to you. And no. we also want to talk to Rena Pakula, mm -hmm. who is a student at UCLA, an aspiring what? Radio personality. Radio personality with a yeah. face like that. Why would we hide that on radio? We ought to have you as a television personality. Right? Well, my other choice is newscasting and sportscasting, but I'm starting off in radio. Because that's all we offer at UCLA, or they offer. UCLA. You want to be a sportscaster or a sport? Sportscaster or a sport. I'm going to invite her to play a round of golf. Nice to see you on the show, Rena. <laughs> of course. You. Let me recap Winter. the score and get out of this as uh, soon as possible. The score is 130 points for Caroline and 40 points for Rena. Of course, I'm just kidding you, Rena. You're a good kid, and Caroline, you're a good kid, too. We'll be right back. so you can feel good about your breath. Clorets with Actizol and Chlorophyll, the breath deodorant. Wrinkles, the cuddly ultra-soft dog that comes to life with a special puppet-like feature. Each one-of-a-kind wrinkles comes with fashion outfit and color-coordinated calico bone by Coleco Industries. The new paper-made metal roller pen doesn't smudge or smear like the leading rollerball pen. The new paper-made metal roller. Members of our studio audience may receive Fisher Price's high chair and car seat feature or one-hand operation. The stroller converts to a carriage and the table and chair set is designed to be durable and safe like all these products. Furnished by Fisher Price. This KitchenAid mixer with attachments can handle most every task from a single egg white to kneading yeast oats. It's a complete food preparer. Welcome back to our show. We have 130 points for Caroline, a lovely lady, and we also have 40 points for Rena, another lovely lady. We got two sharp contestants and a great panel going here. Before we go on with game number two, however, we want to check in with Fred Travelina, who is, uh, has a very busy schedule. Yep. And I would like to know how you balance your family life with that. Well, it gets to be a problem once in a while because of being out of town all the time. You know, you come home and uh, the kids meet you at the door with an 8 by 10 and if you look like it, you're their father, you know. <laughs> but uh, when, when I am home, <laughs> occasionally I get to do episodes on the Smurfs, which is great when their friends come over and they say, my dad's a Smurf. You know, and they say, how can your dad be a Smurf? And I go, hi, kids. Would you like some ice cream and soda? <laughs> no, it's all It works out. <laughs> I would have sworn you just uh, sucked in some helium on that, no. Fred. <laughs> nice to see you on the show, and thanks for great being to be with on us. The show. You're doing really. a great job, too. Well, thank you so much. Uh, tell the producers, and we are in the middle of contract and negotiations. I'm kidding, of course. Oh, Marsha. Dave. Um, yes, Dave. You. And are, that's why you get the big bucks, because you you're so quick on the You are a friend of Crosswitz. <laughs> And you, um... I am. You call it once again, old. <laughs> There's a better way to phrase that. Why don't you interview me? It will go a lot faster. You've well, been doing some talk shows around I've been country. doing some talk shows. And... Well, I've been hosting AM uh, New York, the re uh, AM San Francisco. AM New York, uh, Regis Philbin? AM Cleveland. I'll be done. On all the biggies. How about you AM bet. Chicago? And AM Chicago I was on, yeah. And another old friend, Oprah Winfrey, Oprah who's Winfrey, taking the country yes. by storm. And, Isn't that uh, great? Very nice. Well, nice to see you well, on I love the show. This. I'm I sure myself you're just a in. super talk show host. Speaking of children, as you know, I just got married. I have to go now. I have 17 minutes of childbearing time left. <laughs> is that why your husband is rubbing his hands together in the audience? I, got, I wondered what that... He got ready in the back. All right. Let's move along to game number two. Brad, we're going to get to you at the end of game number two. <laughs> I promise. It's a place that we're looking for. Rena, let's get things going very quickly by picking out a word. Okay, two down. For Jackie, Felix and Oscar were one of Hollywood's oddest what's? C oh, the uh, one of the oddest couple. Bingo! Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Reno. Okay, for Brad, five across. Five across. Victoria's famous ones have a large drop. Ha, ha, have a large what? Drop. Drop. Victoria's. Victoria's. Famous. Oh, could it be dimes? 
dimes. No. D-I-M-E-S. It's Victoria Dime. You know, I don't know if you know about that. No, Rena. <laughs> Victoria's doing famous summer one. stock with Menudo for Have three months. Having a large oh, drop. It's going to be. Do you want me to repeat Show, the show? Shows? I don't... I'm... No. Oh, no. That's <laughs> one wrong answer to Caroline. <laughs> I'll go with five across, please. Five across. Oh, oh, Marsha. Victoria's we'll famous ones have a large drop. Victoria principles. Victoria's principles dropped. That's not it. I'm just keeping busy here till it's her turn. Uh, no, that's not. <laughs> Caroline. I think it's false. Sure. Oh. Nicely done. I knew. <laughs> Dave. Victoria's I knew. have not dropped yet, Marcia. I know, but sorry, Vicky. Fred. Yes. We uh, are going to pick a word for you, Caroline. One across. Here we go. This has charms to soothe a savage breast. Merle, did you write this? This has charms to soothe a savage breast. No idea. Caroline. Music. Yes! Oh. Yeah. You're very breast? sharp, young lady. Or beast. That's what I thought it was. Marsha. We're looking for a word for you. For me, give Caroline. me a cross. Four across. Investors like to get in on the ground what? Well, that's very, very interesting that you should put it that way. The ground floor. Floor. Mm -hmm. Three down? It? Three down? No, no. This goes to Fred. If it rains, you might have to move your barbecue where? Indoors. Indoors. Yeah. Yeah. Caroline, can you solve it? Let's just take three across. All right. Oh, Marcia, this kind of chest can be very cold. This kind of chest? C-H-E-S-T? Yes. Chest uh, cold. No, that's not you said cold, so it can't be that. She stumped. Ice. Ice. Oh, ice. Yeah. Yeah. Looking up at the puzzle, a whole bunch of things filled in. In fact, they're all in there, Caroline. A rink? A rink? Is it? Uh, apparently, we can accept it. We're looking for skating rink or ice rink, but we love you and we'll give you rink. Yes, let's take a look up at the puzzle. Ice indoors, floor falls, music, couples, of course. It all adds up to ice rink or skating rink. Very nicely Would it be done. Rink, David? Yes, skating it's rink. 305 <laughs> points for Caroline, 75 for Rena. Rena, when we come back, it'll be 10 points per letter. We'll give you a chance to catch up. We've got to go to a commercial message. Correction fluids for handwritten mistakes, photocopies, even colored stationery. Clean, neat, liquid paper. It's the perfect solution. Take the fat out of frying. Reduce calories with Mazzola No Stick. The only cooking spray made with pure Mazzola corn oil. Jules Jurgensen's His and Her Classic Series Diamond Dial Watches. Elegantly styled. His with 20 genuine diamonds, hers with 10. Furnished by Jules Jurgensen. Lazy Boy Recline a Rocker Chair. You may enjoy quality and comfort as you rock, recline, or relax. Furnished by Lazy Boy. Welcome back to our third and final game. We have 305 points for Caroline, and Rena has 75 points. Rena, I told you before, we are going to start with you because you're a little bit behind. Ten points per letter. Let's take a look at our game. It's a person that we are looking for, not necessarily a proper name, although it can be. And Rena, we'll start with you and Jackie Zeman. Okay, one down. What cowboys wear under their chaps? Boots, spurs, under their chaps, socks, uh, drying pants. Rena. Spurs, boots, what did she say? Um, <laughs> jeans. Out of time. Caroline. I think we'll go with five down. Five down. Look for the union blank. Fred. You've got to look for the union label. Yes. <laughs> yes, that's right. The union label. Caroline? Uh, now let's go one down. Marcia? David? What do cowboys wear under their chaps? Well, if you're going to be personal, hon, let me put it this way. They wear their jeans. They wear their jeans. Yes. One minute and 30 seconds, Caroline. Hurry up. Uh, how about four across? Four across. John Beresford Tipton is a what? 
millionaire. Yes. yes, I didn't know you were old enough to remember that. Three across. What was Coco Chanel, Marcia? Oh, she was, she made them beautiful clothes, so I guess you would have called her designer. Designer. Two down, please. For protection, knights always held on to their blanks. Fred. The knights always held on to their uh, shields. Yes. yes. <laughs> um... I believe it's maybe Calvin Klein. What are you saying? Is that the answer the to answer five across or the whole puzzle? The whole puzzle. You got it. No Calvin Klein is the person. Let's take a look up at the puzzle. And uh, I think we had Shields uh, label. Yeah, jeans, millionaire, designer, all add up to Calvin Klein, of course. Congratulations, Caroline. You are our winner. And that's nice. Brad, Jackie, uh, Rena was not a winner. She... Uh, she just came in a little too late, and this team over here was pretty pretty hot. Rena, did you have a yeah, good time on the show? I had a great time. Oh, good. And I, uh, <laughs> I wish you the Brad best. Brad did have a good time. Oscar we had a great time. You had a great time, and you're going to be a great radio personality. Don't I know you are. We've got some his and hers Come on, watches make it for you. Huh? We have a recliner for you, <laughs> and we have the very best of wishes <laughs> for you as well. Thank you. Thank you. Your life. Give her a big round of applause. A recliner. You just going to like kick that? Caroline, I'll get to you as soon as Brad is through with his tantrum. Uh, you are our champion. You. Congratulations. You've got to be picking a star to go into the crossfire round with because you'll be playing for a fabulous trip to Micronesia and a chance to drive home one of those brand new cars. Commercial time. We'll be right back. Caroline, and congratulations, young lady. You did a terrific job. She's you had a, just a whole bunch of points amassed, and now you are going on to the crossfire round. I am not surprised <laughs> that you picked Marsha Wallace because she's a very... Well, you know what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying. She's, uh, we've seen her uh, over the course of the week, and she does a very good job on these crossfire rounds. Now, if you win, Michelle. Yes. What's going to happen here? She'll win a dream holiday for two to Micronesia. We'll fly you in a guest round trip from Los Angeles via Continental Airlines Micronesia flight in the comfort of their pub jet service. You may enjoy a five-night stay at the Palau Pacific Resort, a tropical getaway. You may scuba dive and play in a wonderful Pacific Ocean paradise, all furnished by the Palau Pacific Resort. A total package valued at $3,750. Thank you, Michelle. That was very nice. Uh, Caroline, uh, not only do we have the trip to Micronesia for you, but we also have a brand new car. Should you win the crossfire round, you get a shot at it, and Michelle will tell you about at least one of them. David, it could be the Chevrolet Camaro Sports Coupe. Features automatic transmission, AM, FM, stereo, air conditioning, and other features. Furnished by Stock Chevrolet. If you win the crossfire round and the car, you could win over $15,500 in prizes. Yes. <laughs> Uh, Brad, I've got some good news for you. Um, yes, Dave. She says she has no one to take on the trip with her. No one to take. Uh, so, anyway, right. Marsha, are you ready? I'm ready, Good David. luck to you. Good luck to you, okay. Caroline. And as soon as you start me off with a number, we'll get going here. All right. We'll start with four cross. One stroke more than a birdie. Par. Yes. Uh, five down. Climbing plant. Vine. Vine. Ivy. Yes. Uh, oh, six down. The magic dragon. Puff. Yes. Ten across. Spanish celebration. Fiesta. Fiesta. Yes. Seven down. A couch. Sofa. Yes. Nine across. To insult. Uh, a fan. Yes. A fan. Yeah, good. Eight down. An aroma. Odor. Odor. Yes. Three down. Out of shape. Um, uh, oh, two Lamp. Down. Uh, two down. Weak. A, a warning bell. Alarm. Yes. One across. Unsafe. Dangerous. Yes. Three down. Out Three. of shape. Unfit. Yes. <laughs> You are going to Micronesia, absolutely. Hey, listen, when it went, the, the thing on Unfit, I thought, oh my gosh, she's going to get stuck on it, and I was very afraid for you. That's true. And then you filled in what? Dangerous, the yeah, U. That's the U. I am very proud of you, Thank Caroline. You. you did a terrific job, and congratulations. Now, listen, during the commercial break, you gave each of our stars a box. Each box contains the name of one of those cars Golf, Camaro, and Fiero. Which one do you want? The Camaro. I had a suspicion you might cho uh, choose the Camaro. Now, which one of our stars has it? Brad, Jackie, or Fred? Jackie. 
Jackie, look in that box and uh, see if there is an answer. <laughs> what, what am I, the play? <laughs> the golf. Who had the, uh, who had the Camaro? Watch. 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 But the idiot had it. <laughs> Fred had the... When I got you the are going to Micronesia. Bye, You're going to have the greatest time of your life. And congratulations, have... Caroline. It's been fun having you on the show. Marsha, once again, you're superstars. Love you all. Love you, Brad. I truly do. Jackie and Fred. My name is David Sparks. We'll see you next time on Crosswoods. Bye-bye.